Actress Frances McDormand is known for her genuine performances that truly connect with audiences. She's great at becoming her characters, whether they're strong or vulnerable. People often love her role in Fargo because it mixes dark humor and gripping drama so well. Her way of showing emotions in a subtle yet deep manner really sticks with people. Share your stories about this amazing actor below and get ready for some interesting facts in this video. Frances McDormand, born in the late 1950s, emerged as a standout actress through her unwavering commitment to the craft. Her raw and authentic performances drew audiences into the worlds she portrayed on screen. She delves deep into characters' psyches, portraying their complexities with honesty, setting her apart in cinema. Her significance goes beyond accolades. McDormand fearlessly pursued roles challenging societal norms. Whether playing a determined police officer or a grieving mother seeking justice, each performance exuded realism and vulnerability resonating globally. Beyond the silver screen, McDormand influenced the industry, advocating for diversity and representation. Her impact extends to future generations of actors. In summary, McDormand's undeniable impact on cinema lies in her authentic portrayals, commitment to pushing boundaries and advocacy for diversity, making her a true silver screen icon. Frances McDormand is one of the 25 actresses who have won an Academy Award for their performances in comedies. Her memorable role in Fargo earned her this recognition. Previous winners include Claudette Colbert for It Happened One Night and Loretta Young for The Farmer's Daughter. In the movie, she portrays Marge Gunderson. There's a scene where she avoids a traditional Scandinavian dish called lutefisk at a buffet. Lutefisk is made from dried whitefish soaked in a strong alkaline solution. It's known for its unique jelly-like texture and strong smell. Interestingly, Madison, Minnesota is known for having the highest consumption of lutefisk in the U.S. McDormand has a son named Pedro McDormand Cohen, whom she adopted from Paraguay in 1994. Frances McDormand, famous for her role as Marge Gunderson in Fargo, comes from Monison, Pennsylvania. She was the youngest of three children adopted by her father, a minister, and his wife. Marge Gunderson, portrayed by McDormand, is one of her most memorable roles. Interestingly, she and director Joel Cohen, whom she married in 1984, have worked together on several projects. They have one child together. Growing up in Pennsylvania and being part of a minister's family influenced McDormand's journey into acting. Her performance as Marge Gunderson in Fargo showcases her talent and range as an actress. Frances McDormand, a talented actress known for her roles in theater and film, received a Tony Award nomination in 1988 for a play called A Streetcar Named Desire. She gained fame for playing pregnant characters like Marge Gunderson in the movie Fargo, which won her an Oscar for Best Actress. She's one of only 13 actresses to win an Oscar for such a role. In the film Shortcuts, she portrayed Betty Weathers, a character whose story intertwines with others. McDormand worked with the Cohen brothers beyond acting. She's married to Joel Cohen. This connection led to her role in Fargo, where she received much praise. Her talent and versatility have made her a respected figure in entertainment. Her work continues to captivate audiences and inspire aspiring actors. Frances McDormand accomplished an impressive feat in cinema, winning top awards like the Critics' Choice Award, Golden Globe, Screen Actors Guild, BAFTA, and Oscar all in one year for her role in three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. This puts her in a special group with other talented actors like Julia Roberts, Renee Zellweger, and Kate Winslet, who also did the same. In Raising Arizona, she played Dot. This movie also starred Nicolas Cage and Holly Hunter, who later won Academy Awards like Frances McDormand did for Nomadland, three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri, and Fargo. Another important role for her was as Betty Weathers in Shortcuts. This film had a cast with four Oscar winners, Jack Lemmon, Tim Robbins, Frances McDormand, and Julian Moore, plus eight Oscar nominees like Bruce Davison, Ann Archer, and Jennifer Jason Leigh. Frances McDormand's talent shines through her performances, placing her among the most celebrated actors of her generation. Frances McDormand, known for her roles in various films, is recognized for her talent in acting. She is related to Ethan Coen and Tricia Cook through marriage. McDormand stands among a select group of actresses who have achieved what is known as the Triple Crown of Acting, which includes winning an Oscar, an Emmy, and a Tony Award. This distinguished list includes names like Helen Hayes, Ingrid Bergman, Shirley Booth, and others. 
Despite her notable achievements, McDormand experienced a gap of 12 years between receiving Oscar nominations for her roles in North Country and three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. This hiatus demonstrates the variability of recognition in the film industry. Abby, portrayed by Frances McDormand, made a strong impact in the movie Blood Simple. In a 1996 interview, she shared stories about the cast. She mentioned that M. Emmett Walsh, who played a crucial role, was the oldest person on set. It's interesting to hear about the interactions among the actors behind the scenes. For example, Abby used to share an apartment with Joel Cohen, Ethan Cohen, Sam Raimi, Scott Spiegel, and Holly Hunter, which fostered a creative and supportive atmosphere. Abby's background includes Canadian roots. Her adoptive parents were both from Canada. Her father, the Reverend Vernon Weir McDormand, was a minister from Nova Scotia, while her mother, Noreen Alois McDormand, was a nurturing presence as a housewife and nurse from Ontario. Her diverse experiences undoubtedly added depth to her acting. This combination of personal background and professional commitment makes Abby's performances very compelling. Indeed, Blood Simple showcases Abby's versatility and talent. Frances McDormand portrayed Marge Gunderson in the famous movie Fargo. In many memorable scenes, she shares intimate moments with Norm, often shown either in bed or enjoying meals together. Another standout role was her character Dot in Raising Arizona, showing how versatile she is as an actress. Interestingly, she and Holly Hunter, her co-star in the film, were roommates during their time at Yale School of Drama in the early 80s. However, it was in three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri that McDorman truly showcased her talent. The role suited her perfectly, showing how skilled she is and the respect she has in the industry. Indeed, her ability to portray characters with depth and authenticity has solidified her status as one of Hollywood's most esteemed actresses. This text was, Frances McDormand holds a unique place in Hollywood. She's the only actress among a select few to have earned an Oscar nomination for a performance directed by her spouse. This recognition came for her role in Fargo, directed by Joel Cohen. Others who've achieved similar nods include Elizabeth Bergner, Joanne Woodward, Gene Simmons, Jenna Rollins, and Julie Andrews, though their nominations weren't under the direction of their partners. McDormand's debut film, Blood Simple, introduced her to audiences, marking the beginning of her notable career. She played Abby in this thriller, showcasing her talent right from the start. Another notable achievement is being the first actress to secure two Screen Actors Guild Awards for Outstanding Performance by a female actor in a leading role. She earned these honors for her roles in Fargo and three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. Frances McDormand's journey in cinema is marked by distinction and talent, setting her apart as a trailblazer in the industry. Frances McDormand made headlines during her acceptance speech at the Oscars for her role in three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri in 2017. She mentioned the term inclusion writer, leaving many puzzled. Essentially, it's a clause actors can demand in their contracts to ensure diversity among the cast and crew of a film. This idea stemmed from a 2016 TED Talk by Stacey Smith addressing the lack of representation in casting. McDormand's mention sparked discussions about equity clauses and inclusion writers as potential solutions. In her role as Marge Gunderson in Fargo, McDormand drew comparisons to characters from Cagney and Lacey and Columbo. This showcases her versatility and ability to bring unique depth to her characters. Furthermore, she served as the jury president of the Berlin Film Festival in 2004, demonstrating her influence and standing in the film industry.